the reverse method is an easy way to convert our text data into some numerical form. With this method, we first create a vocabulary from all the unique words in our documents, and we calculate the occurrences. The occurrences can be calculated as binary, word counts, or frequencies. Let's have a simple example. Assume we have these three documents, and we are going to calculate the word counts. We create a vocabulary from these documents, and we place them in our columns and then we calculate the word counts. Term frequency is similar to word counts. This time we are going to normalize the row counts by the total number of terms in that specific document. And this is going to increase the weight for common words in that specific document. And this is the equation for this. When we calculate the term frequencies for our example documents, this is what we have. Inverse document frequency is calculated for each word in our vocabulary, and it decreases the weight for commonly used words in our vocabulary, and increases the weight for some rare words in the vocabulary. We calculate the IDF for each term, and it can be calculated with this equation. For example, for the, for the word cat in our vocabulary, the IDF score is 1.18. Term frequency inverse document frequency, TF-IDF. This combines the term frequencies and the inverse document frequency scores. Here we can give the IDF equation like this. When we calculate the TF-IDF for our sample documents, this is what we have. n-grams are sequences of n tokens from a given text. We can use n-grams with our big of words representation as well. Let's have a simple example. Assume this is our sentence. It is not a dog. It is a wolf. 1 gram is just single tokens, and 2 grams are these. 